Hello, my name is Rachi, and I am here to show you how to uh, import uh, the Mario Strikers Community NAND into your Dolphin. Um, so first thing, uh, what does this mean? What is a NAND? So a NAND is a um, basically like a replica of the save data on your Wii. It includes uh, your game data. It includes um, your Mii's data. It includes like the keys it uses to connect to online. Um, all that kind of stuff is stored in your NAND. Um, so what does this do for us? This allows um, Dolphin players to be able to play against uh, Wii players using the Nintendo or the replacement for the Nintendo Wi-Fi connection called WiiMFi. Um, so, without further ado, uh, let me show you what you're going to do. Uh, first thing you're going to do is you're going to head over uh, to the Mario Strikers charged uh, command sandbox here. And we're going to type in, we're going to use the command community NAND. You can see I've, I've used it a couple times earlier. Uh, what it's going to do is it's going to um, send you to a link here. Link has the download to uh, nan.bin and keys.bin. It also has data.bin as well. This is a uh, Mario Strikers Charge save file that has mostly everything unlocked. I would just ignore that for now. I need to just do a little bit more testing on that. But you do have nan dot bin and keys dot bin all right so uh first thing you're going to do uh is when you download these you need to make sure you know to download you can just go to the triple dots and hit download or whatever um so anyway first thing you're going to do is make sure nan dot bin and keys dot bin are in the same folder um, so when I go to my downloads here, you can see NAND and keys are right here in my downloads folder. Um, so just to kind of illustrate my point of what it's going to do, first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to go into MSC. Well, this is before I'm doing the actual import here. I'm going to go into, um, I'm going to go into the game. And this is the location you go to queue up a game against a Wii player, Nintendo Wi-Fi connection. And you can see here it says at least one Mii is required to play. Because we don't have any Mii's created or anything like that. Basically what the import of the NAND is going to do is it's going to allow for uh, some, you know, some placeholder Mii's to be selected that you can play with. So... Um, without further ado, uh, let's do it. So first thing you're going to do is you're going to do tools, export all saves. Uh, this is just going to make sure um, if you have like saves that you, you know, I don't know. I haven't really cleaned up the NAND or anything like that. If you have saves that you don't want overwritten, this is going to allow you to do that. So I'm just going to create a folder called We Saves. This is going to basically back up your data in like all your Wii saves into like a folder. So this is a relatively new dolphin. It only exported the one save here. Um, so now I am going to uh, import the NAND. So to do that, I'm going to go to tools. Manage NAND, import boot me NAND backup. I'm going to hit yes. It's telling you, do you want to overwrite? That's fine. Um, and what you have here is NAND.bin with your keys.bin. Again, you just want to make sure the keys are in the same directory as the NAND. Um, in this case, our directory is downloads. It should be fine. Just double click the NAND. And in it goes. 
Now, when I launch MSC, if you're familiar with Dolphin, you're familiar with um, the many crashes it has. Obviously, this was an instance of a crash. So let me launch it again. Okay, in I go. Now when I go to Nintendo Wi-Fi connection, it says new Nintendo Wi-Fi connection save data will now be created. Ah, that's fine. And you have your selection of Mii's here that you can use to um, play your games. Um, yeah, so, you know, pick whoever you want from here. You're going to hit OK. You're going to hit Use This Me. It's going to connect. Logging in. Getting statistics. Um, and you're in. Basically, here you are in the Nintendo Wi-Fi Central. Um, to get your friend code, just go to Friend Roster here. Your friend code is located right up here. If you want to add other friends, you can do that using the add friend here and enter other people's friend codes. Um, one other extra step you can do, if you so choose, is uh, you can um, add it to your profile on um, on the Mario Strikers, um, on the Mario Strikers Discord, and I'll show you how to do that right now. So you can see here, the friend code is four six eight seven five three four two three nine two two. Um, I want to make sure I get this right here, so I'm going to run the sandbox command. So add FC. And then it's going to be pal, and then we're going to put our code in there. So what I'll do is I'll do add FC. Uh, this is the pal version of the game. And then we can put in this number here. So 468753. 468753423922. tells me it's successfully added now when I do my profile you can see here at the bottom here is that four six four where is it four six eight seven five three yeah four six eight seven five three four two three nine two two which is this code I've added now when someone challenges you to your game if you want to add that person Add friend, and you would put, you know, whatever code you need to put in. In. Um, if you have any questions, uh, please let me know. My, um, again, I'm Rachi or Rocky. Um, just ping me in the Mario Strikers Discord, and I will do my best to answer any questions you have. Uh, thanks for watching. Uh, let me know if you have any questions. Again, bye bye.